Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. Let's continue the ReactJS tutorial series. Now in this video tutorial, I will explain how to get an even or odd numbers from an array of objects. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. I'm using Visual Studio Code to create a ReactJS application. Just for the time saving, I have already created the project chkml insert is my project name and I have created this project in the above folder. Let me expand my application the project and notice in my project there is a source folder. All my ReactJS components I am adding in this source folder. So for this example also I am creating one new component which is a class component I am creating in this source folder. Right click the source folder, new file, and the file name I'm giving even odd.js. And here we got the even odd.js file. Now, to create a React.js component, in React.js, there are two types of components one is functional component, and the second one is a class component. Here in this example, I'm creating the class component. But before creating a class component, first we must import the React class from the React library. Let's add that one first. Import React from React library. After that, I'm adding one class called even odd extends. I'm extending the component. And after that, every class at the end line, there must be the export default even odd, which is my component name. So after that, in class component, there are two important methods we must add. One is the render method. Inside the render method, there is a return method. And this return method will display the HTML elements on the browser. So first we need to add the root element. Do is a root element. The parent element do is a parent element. If you want to add more than one HTML element in a React.js component, we must include or we must add between the div components. Let's add one H1 tag display or get get even or odd numbers numbers from an array h3 track react js tutorials after that i'm adding one horizontal line now after the horizontal line, what I'm doing in the render method, I'm defining one variable to create an array. Let's define array is equals to, let's give some array numbers 99, 8, 54, 0, 3, 2, 28, 6, 99, 99 is already there. So I'm adding one four twenty five. Let's add two fifty six eighty nine. I have created an array with some random numbers. After that, I'm declaring another variable to get an output to display the output. The uh, to get the even or odd numbers for that I'm using array dot I'm adding the filter method filter method this filter method it takes two parameters the value and index number of array so here I'm defining an x divided by I'm dividing by 2 here the x values are the array numbers when I am dividing these array numbers with 2 I must get 0 if the value gets 0 it's an even number 
now this is the output I'm expecting mm, let's put this in the center tag Sun tag strong mm, not strong we'll add one more h1 tag between curly brackets I'm adding the output which is the result value uh, output dot join method because I want to display the commas also between its join is a string parameter it will takes comma and I'm giving space between the two numbers that's it and this output I'm expecting the even numbers from this array so let's save this file save all before run this component we must configure our component in index.js file the index.js file is inside the source folder here it is the index.js file open that one and notice the index.js file it's running app component the default component is running i'm deleting this component and i'm adding my new component which is the even odd as well as we need to import in the header section that's it let's save this file now we'll check the output for that go to view click terminal and here we got our terminal which is nothing but a PowerShell also and notice the path is d column the folder name which is a folder name this is a folder name is here and inside this folder i have my project so let's add my project to this path chk mul insert enter so after adding the correct path now i can able to run my component on the browser with there is a command called npm start enter and here we got the output displaying the even numbers if we check our array which contains 99 3 89 54 3 they're not displaying here it displaying the even numbers now if you want to get the odd numbers from this narrative just simply add one here let's save this file save all now we'll get the odd numbers from this narrative let's check the output see here we got 99 3 89 we got only three numbers which are the odd numbers in this array let's add 7 also which is the odd number we'll check again save all this is 7 if you want to get even numbers just simply add 0 here multiply by 2 is equal to 0 we will get the even numbers if you want to get the odd numbers just is equals to 1 to get the odd numbers 0 for even numbers see here we got the even numbers that's it in this video tutorial I will explain how to get the even or odd numbers from an array in react.js thanks for watching Please subscribe my channel, we will catch you in my next video tutorial.